today's trip to the thrift is gonna be a little bit different. I've said to Courtney that she could have full access to my business credit card and make all of the purchase decisions in today's video. But I've given her a bit of a challenge as well. I've said that she's gotta work her way up the profit pyramid. And if she can do that, she can have whatever reward that she wants. And she said that she wanted to go out for beers. All right, here's today's plan of attack. We need to find 10 items. Four of them need to be $20 profit items, not revenue, profit. You need to find three $30 profit items, two $40, and one Holy Grail $50 item. If we can achieve this, that'll mean that we get $300 in profit for the day, and our reward is to go out for beers. It's gonna be really interesting to see if Courtney can tick this off today. Let's go and see how she does. Courtney, this is going to put you to the test here because I've seen quite a bit here. We're in the DVD section. It's a section that I know very well. I don't know about Courtney though. There's not much here. Is that what you're looking at? Definitely not enough. Is that what you're looking at? Did you say Death in Paradise? Yes. Is that what you're looking at? I was looking at that one. So we've got actually series 10, 5, 9, 6, 8, 4, and 7. So a bunch of mixed. I've got a good feeling about this one. This one here? Yep. This will be good. If there's any op shop people watching this, Courtney's got a message. <laughs> 50 cent op shop books, please. All right, so we're gonna go with this. We've got a book for Courtney, Helter Skelter. You're gonna read that yourself first, aren't you? Yeah. And then we've got this RSPCA Animal Tales. That was looking pretty good. And then Courtney also found these Ronald Dahl books. There were 15 of them, and I believe it's gonna cost us $5, but we'll have to go and find out. All right, so I've ticked off two of the $20 profits. Um, this one here, the RSPCA Animal Tales. It's a set of 10 books that we got for purchase of $2.50. Uh, the comps are saying 40, shipping will be around 12, so that just gets 20. So I'm saying that that counts. Um, this one here, the Ronald Dahl, this one's better. This one's a set of, what's it, 15? Yeah, 15 in that one. 15, $2.50 for the 15 as well. Selling for 50. And that'll be about 15 probably to ship. So that's about 25 profit. 25 and 20. So that technically gets this one ticked off and this one ticked off. So we've got two of the two uh, $20 profits. So we've got another eight to go. We need some big boppers, but it's nice to get underway with a couple of book bundles. The bookworm strikes again. Fifteen. They'll go into a small satchel for seven seventy. So twenty bucks. All right, Courtney's found these. First of all, I, do, I actually want to say these here. These are the Asics GT two thousands. Really, really good pair of running shoes. These. We we're just a bit concerned by the soles. There was just a little bit of wear on them. Um, but fifteen dollars. I think we should be able to go ahead and put them. Maybe about sixty. You reckon? Sixty. Yeah. Clean them up a bit. Clean them up a bit. Definitely clean them up. But we're gonna. Um, I mean, they're like an eighty or a ninety dollar shoe. So if we go down for sixty, given the given the condition of the sole, that's probably gonna get us a thirty dollar profit. So I reckon you can put that down as one of your thirties. Yeah. And then this one here. This is the fourth and final twenty dollar profit item. So this is the Machina Twos. Um, it's an Under Armour. The condition of this one is so much better. Yeah. Um, Fifteen should go into fifty, and that's twenty dollars profit at the end of the day. So. Four twenty dollar ones ticked off, and we've got our first thirty dollar one. The shoes are a very good category, guys. Go in with positive energy. Bring us the results. What are these? These you did a pink and white one like this. Yep, I've done these before. These are good. How much are they? Fifty dollars. But they're brand new. Pretty much brand new. This is a good brand, guys. Salomon. These are the Speed Cross 3s. And they are pretty much brand new. $50. I've sold a pair before for $180. And they were used. I don't know. They weren't exactly a Speed Cross 3, though. So I'll have to do some research on that. But this could be our first $40 to $50 profit item. This is a massive call as well. I have the card. Yes, I have the card. You do? <laughs> what do you think we should do? Because that's a big expense on one item. 
it is, but that was help. I think it's more that you want beers. No, I did not say that. I said think it was help. <laughs> you just want the beers. All right, let's do it. Now, the concern that we've got here is that we've only got an hour left before all of these stores close. So I just don't know if we're going to be able to find these big ticket items that we need to tick off this, this challenge. And Courtney wants her beers. So you're all right. You're going to have to go to work. So we just found the child, um, seven, the Jack Reacher. This is one you know very well. Yeah, I do. Courtney found this on her six part video series starting from scratch. Yeah, I got 10 same price, sell $2 each, so it was 20 bucks to cost me. So these are all $2? Yeah. Two bucks, and the comps on eBay, how much? Yeah, around like 65 70 ish 65 70 yeah, 70 80 So we're going to say 70 Shipping would be about 15 Um, Cost, what was the cost? 14 14 So 30, $30. There's our $30 profit item. I didn't realise this, guys, but it's actually half price day at Vinnie's stores today. So that's just going to make our assignment even easier. We need another 30, we need another 40. Actually, two 30s and a 40. So, let's use this Finney's promotion to find ourselves some profit. Have a look at these things. The Simpsons. Some Bart Simpson vans. And they're only $10. If anyone's watching that might be interested in these, they are a men's US 8, a women's US 9.5. Very cool pair of shoes. And today in store, that'll only be $5. We've got these as well. These are the Nike React Escape RNs. Um, condition is very good. I'm buying them because they're only $4. Do they hit our profit margin of 30 bucks? I don't think so, although I haven't checked comps yet. Um, the condition's just so good and the deal is just so good that I've got to do it. US eight and a half on that one there. That's a women's um, pair of shoes. Uh, I also found this one as well. Um, Kitchen Nightmares USA Series One. Um, that one goes for about 15, so not too bad. It'll be about 50 cents in here today. All right, so that sale was really good. We got um, two shoes out of it. Both of them hit our $30 profit, two left. Um, so these vans, Simpsons vans, we bought for $5 for half price will sell into 60 so that hits the 30 um, and these ones were only four dollars and they'll sell for around probably about fifty dollars so also another thirty dollar profit um, so done done so we've got two more to do two more forty dollar profit items and then we can go and get some beers these just come in they're amazing yeah. They're hundreds of dollars each. They are, aren't they? Are they? Yeah. Second hand online, hundreds of dollars. Yeah. That second, that second one. Yeah. That one's getting online used, 300 bucks at the moment. 300 used. Sunday service. Sunday service. Uh, it's, um, what about Kanye? Is that Kanye? Oh, we'll get that. We'll get Kanye. 100% we'll get that. And they just came in today. Half an hour ago. Do you know what this one is? That one is. It's a cheap one. It's only about two fifty online. It's a cheap one. <laughs> two fifty cheap. Well, those ones, the cream one you got at the bottom. Yeah. That's twelve hundred dollars. Which one? Is it this one? This one's twelve hundred dollars online. Twelve hundred. Yep. How do you know it's genuine? Oh, because we know where they came from. Oh, you know where they came from. <laughs> All right, well, they're, we, aren't they? they're amazing. Um, how much is it going to be for all of it? A tenth of retail value. $45 each. A tenth of it. Well, it's genuine, isn't it? Yeah. They're $45. 45, they're all 45 Yeah, they're all $45. Okay. So that, that, many and then, that one's 500 alone. Genuine. Yeah. I'm kidding you not. You retail that one up, you find it. And 500 bucks. You, Supreme, well, that one's a, like not the best Supreme I've ever seen, but it's still going to do all right. Genuine Supreme jumpers go for like. Yeah, I know. Don't this, tell me. This is insane. I, I can't believe it. Go buy Yeezy. Oh, go on. You can buy Yeezy. I love, I oh, know, I love Kanye. So do I. I haven't heard of Mad Happy though. But then yeah, these are supreme. I think they were between three and five. Three and five. Yeah, the cloud control, cloud culture was 200. Brand new, not pre-owned. I think it's a bit of, some of them are just in bed and nick. Like that to me looks pre-owned. Yeah, yeah. but those prices you were saying, 
Yeah, That'd be well, brand new. Yeah, the Yeezy one it was on Poshmark. It was a second yeah. one. 300. Yeah. 300 on it. Yeah. yeah. Um, and, you know, it's so cancelled now, so it's going to go and go up in value. Go up in value, yeah. Yeah, so, yeah, no, fantastic. I hate you, Dave, so I was going to buy that. <laughs> and the Travis Scott pants. Do you know these ones? All right, so which one are the Catalyst? That's yeah. a really good label. Catalyst. This one, someone wants to But not as much. No. I only think they only retail a couple of hundred. Couple of hundred. Yeah, oh, yeah, that's all. Oh. They, I think these are the best, Ash. Yeah, you have. You've got the best. The best. best of the best. Can I ask Hello. where it came from? Some amazing donor in the Burley community. Oh, so you don't know? No, he brought it into the doors. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But he brought it in summer, so I, I stashed them. Oh, you stashed so them for winter? Yeah. Are you, oh, I can't tell what he in summer. So we think it, uh, he was going away to mm. like a warmer climate. Right. Yeah. But this is an unusual. Yeah. It's, yeah. it's incredible. With brands. You even got the Travis Scott pants. God, I hate you. Travis Scott. So, Astro World. Astro World. Yeah. So 230, thank you. 2.30. Thank you very much. I still can't believe that that just happened. I know, it's crazy. <laughs> $230. We've got six items of clothing here. They're all designer. They are all genuine. And they're brands that you just simply never see in thrift stores, at least here in, on the Gold Coast where I'm from. I've been doing this for three years. I've never come across something like this. A bundle like that. Just a bundle. And, and then there's all that conversation from the girls in the op shop. Like, you could just tell there was nothing, nothing about this wasn't genuine. Um, so first one off guys, we do have the Astro World, Travis Scott, Wish You Were Here, Thrills and Chills, Tracksuit Pants. These are insane, out of this world on there as well. This is, a, I believe this is a women's large. There it is there. It's on a champion reverse weave large, but I think, I don't know about you, but I, do you think that's a, a chick's large? Yeah, yeah, because the length is like kind of like my length. Yeah, I think that's, I think that is women's. Yeah. I think that's 100% women's. The next one, it might be a women's as well. I don't know. Um, but we've got a Supreme, genuine Supreme Champion, two amazing brands. This is a collab between the two, Supreme Champion. Um, we've got a large as well. $25 we paid for both tracksuit pants. The value on this one, I should say, it was about $80. And then this one here, we reckon we can get about $100 in pre-owned condition. Um, the condition of it is amazing. That's yeah. the thing. All of this stuff is in such good nick. It's all like new. It is all like new. And you could almost, you could almost list it up as like new. Um, we reckon we can get about 100 for that. I think it's a women's large as well. So two tracksuit pants in women's large. Um, these though are extra large, which is dangerous for me because I'm an extra large. Um, I actually personally didn't know about this brand. This is Mad Happy. Um, so we've got the local Optimus group. This was $45. It's a size extra large. I think it's a men's extra large. I yeah. think that'd fit me. I don't know if it's a women's or a men's. Definitely a men's, I reckon. Men's, yeah. yeah. Um, but this, I really like the color of it. Obviously, the condition of it is excellent, and the Mad Happy uh, jumpers. If you put this onto eBay, they all go between two to three hundred dollars. Um, obviously, given the fact that this is pre-owned, we're thinking what one hundred and seventy-five. It only gets better though, guys. The next one up, we've got Acme Studios. Um, this one here, I'll show you the tag. There it is. There, Acme Studios. Um, so this one again, it's an extra large. It's got the Acme face on the back. Really cool back print on this one as well. Forty-five dollars. What were the um, brand new ones on this? This was like brand new was five hundred dollars. This is like a five hundred dollar brand crazy. new. Crazy, yeah. Um, pre-owned condition, we think we can get about two fifty. Yeah. So about two hundred and fifty bucks in pre-owned nick for this jumper right here, which is just insane. Yeah. Um, Acme Studios, some huge numbers when you search any amount of clothing of, of the uh, Acme Studios brand. Now, this is this is where things really pick up, guys. We've got some genuine Supreme. This is a size extra large. We've paid $45 for it. Um, and these, there's a StockX, a brand new version on StockX of this exact colorway, $550, wasn't it? Yeah. It was about 550 bucks on StockX. Um, just insane, in excellent condition. No holes, no rips, no dirt stains. Just crazy to pick it up for $45. You'll list that one for $299? I'll go $2.99, yeah. yeah. We're going to go $2.99. We're also going to go $2.99 on this one here. So this is the Holy Spirit's um, Sunday service Kanye jumper. Um, obviously, with everything going on with Kanye at the moment, they're not making these things anymore, which means that the value is only going more and more up. Um, this one, again, it's a size extra large. We paid the $45 for it. And this one here was the same as the uh, Supreme jumper, wasn't it? Yeah. This was, again, another five to $600 jumper, brand new condition. We think that we should be able to sell this one for around about 300. Yeah. So two jumpers, Supreme, Kanye, 300 a piece. We did the mass on all of it. And in pre-owned condition, the resale value on all of this stuff 
is twelve hundred bucks. Twelve hundred dollars from two thirty, and we paid two hundred and thirty to get it. I don't think I have um, ever come across a deal, at least shot. in a thrift store, that epic before. And that also means one thing, that we can cross off these puny little $40 profit, and that is our day. Well done, Corny. Amazing. I spend big. You spend big. Oh, we actually did spend a lot of money today, considering that was 230 and then everything else throughout the day. Yeah. Uh, it's 5 o'clock, the op shops are closed, and we've ticked off our list. So that means we get to go and have beers. <laughs> Say, what have you got to say, girls? Oh, 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 oh no.